But Jonah wasn't thinking logically. Instead, he succumbed to his emotions. If he could get out of Israel quickly enough, he reasoned, Nineveh wouldn't be warned and God would have to destroy it. Jonah packed his few things and hurried to the seaport of Joppa on the coast of Dan. He bought passage on a large ship headed to what is now known as the Rock of Gibraltar in Spain. This is in the opposite direction of Nineveh and about as far away from Assyria as he could get. Jonah sincerely hoped that God would forget about him. After the vessel left port, Jonah went below the deck to sleep. He was still slumbering when the sea started to get choppy. Soon the wind was howling and the vessel was swaying wildly back and forth from the battering of the angry waves. But it wasn't until the captain of the ship jolted him that Jonah awoke. Wake up! the captain yelled. How can you sleep at a time like this? Jonah stumbled upstairs as the vessel shook violently. He gaped when he beheld the ferocity of the sea. 